Yo everybody, Rhino here, a DLive.TV streamer. Uh, we're gonna do a quick tutorial on how to set up Streamlabs OBS to stream on DLive.TV. Hope you guys enjoy. We're not gonna go too in depth. It'll be a basic, simple, hey, just to get you going. Hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so here we are on the DLive.TV homepage. Um, this is what you'll see when you first log into the website. Um, I'm, gonna, we, I'm going to assume you already have some knowledge of the site, so we're not gonna go too in the depth. Um, what you're gonna wanna do is go up here to the top right to the little camera, click on it, it's gonna bring you to a dashboard. Um, here's where you can change the stream title, your language, um, what game category you're in, so like Apex Legends, Fortnite, etc. cetera. Um, bad words filter, um, anything that you want filtered out of your chat, obviously you'd put here. Um, you can choose a thumbnail that you want for your replay. Um, but right here in encoding server information is where we're gonna get our stream key and URL. So click on that. It's gonna bring up this box. Um, please make sure that you have set keyframe equals two in your broadcasting software. So we'll get to that. So don't close this out. You're gonna wanna bring up Streamlabs OBS. Here we go. In the top right of that, you're gonna wanna go to settings. Then you're gonna wanna click on stream. And here on stream type, make sure you select custom streaming server. So as you can see, it's showing URL and stream key. So if you go back into DLive and this box, you're gonna to wanna to copy your stream URL, go back into OBS, paste that there, come back here, copy your stream key and post that there. And then you'll hit done. Um, that gives all the V information you need to go live um, and remember, we gotta change the keyframe to two. So, and click on output, go to output mode, make sure it's on advanced. Um, I'm going to assume you already know how to set some of this stuff up. There's plenty of videos out there, maybe I'll make one, but um, like I said, this video is just based on the knowledge that you know how to do all this. Um, and then make sure down here at keyframe interval, you have it on two. And then you're gonna hit done, and you're ready to go. So, when you're ready to go live, don't worry about this, this is gonna pop up. Um, this doesn't really work with DLive yet, so you can just kind of leave a blank, confirm, go live, and you're good to go. Um, where you can change your title, like I said, is all here. So all this information is what's gonna show up on your stream. I hope that makes sense. Let me know if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, and looking forward to seeing you guys on DLive.tv.